In today's video, we will do very small project on uh, web scrapping. It is the live project. So for example, we have um, alipapa.com, this website. And uh, we are, for example, we try to look uh, mobile. So here you can see we are getting uh, different types of uh, information about the, the product and uh, the seller information and then we have a uh, rating and here, here you can see this uh, rating received on time so it's a little, little bit uh, hidden so I, I can't read the complete uh, rating here and uh, some of the attributes are hidden and in the same way if I try to search for example paper so here you can see we are getting different types of results here and um, we need to grab all this data and uh, then we need to make a report so let's do it with the help of uh, power query how easy it is so if you click uh, alibaba.com the home tab and here it is mobile and uh, you can see the the url here this is alibaba.com slash trade search and then uh, we have at the end we have and search text is equal to mobile and if I write here for example paper so here you can see we are getting all the results according to our search query so we will take this URL and go to the power query editor and here we have to click get data web and then we need to paste the URL here click OK so here you can see we are getting uh, different tables like if you click the table 1 so this is the data here we are getting in the column one this is the product name then the other is the price range then we have uh, the order quantity in the column four and this is the like order type and we have here the fifth column this is the name of the seller and a lot of other information normally we have to go to each and every seller one by one and then we try to see or different stuff there and if you click in the table 2 these are the I think maybe is about shipping so table 3 uh, table 4 so you can see we are getting different uh, types of uh, information that is available on the website and here we need we are interested in the column 1 you need to click control column 2 maybe 3 4 the seller information and uh, then we need we are also interested in the feedback the, the rating so right click and remove other columns so these are the stuff in which we are interested so now you can make uh, the the name of the column you you can rename it uh, like products the second is price and maybe you can delete this one as well so this is the order quantity this one is the seller and uh, this column is is the rating this one so we need to order because everything the, the type of every column is is a text right this is also a text so what we can do is we can fetch the minimum amount and then we can do ascending or descending or here you can see 0 0.21 dash 0 0.36 so this is the minimum amount and this is the maximum amount so how we can get this amount here so first of all we need to extract um, information so we need to extract all the digits uh, before 
dash. So first we need to find the position of uh, this number minus this 0.21 dash. So for this we need to click add column, add custom column. And here we have to write the, the name of the column is price and we have to use one function here and uh, takes dot position text of position of and uh, it okay let me remove this one so that the intelligence can work so the first is the first parameter is the text as a text this is the price and uh, then the substring will be dash so this one click ok and here you can see we are getting this is the index of the, this dash right and here we are getting minus one because there is no dash available here so we need all these digits before dash so for this we again need to click setting and here we have to use one function here that is again text function text dot start and uh, it takes the first parameter is the the name of the, the column that is price and uh, then the second is so that's it click ok so here you can see we are getting like a 0 0.21 dash 0 0.64 and we are getting again 0 0.64 the minimum value and here we are getting error because we don't have any value available at uh, minus one position so we need to fix this error just need to click here and uh, then we have to use it one function error handling this is like um, try try this otherwise the original column price that's it click ok and here you can see we are getting no error here so now we change the data type for example we can change to fixed decimal number and uh, then we also need to sort this column as a uh, ascending order so that's it now we can load it close and apply and we have to add one table here so the first column will be products then we need price and here we have custom this is the we have to change here the the name like a minimum min price and uh, we can also put here one like the rating and here we have to increase the text size so here you can see we have added products price and min price and uh, rating so we can put do here like in, in ascending order so here you can see this is the this product is the like the minimum order price is 0 0.01 0 0.03 0 0.05 and so on so we 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 have to do one more thing we need to go to the power query editor and we have to add here some uh, parameters manage parameters new parameter and the parameter name is products and uh, the type is, is text it's just a value the list of values and here you can see here you can write mobile 
पेपर लैपटॉप watch okay so here you can choose mobile and uh, the current value is also mobile click okay so this is the static parameter and we can uh, we can rename this like f so we need to copy go here in the table one and here we have to again we, we need to go to the view and the advanced query editor here you can see this is the url that we have pasted here that belong to paper so what we need to do here we need to put quotation here and sign and uh, here we have to write and uh, now it's done so now this url is dynamic right click ok Okay, so here you can see we are getting mobile and uh, this is the mobile data and if I load, close and apply, you don't need to search and type, you just need to select here and it's, it's very easy, Power Query will automatically fetch all the stuff, the price range, the minimum price, the order and you can fetch, as, as you have seen, we have a lot of information available and uh, you can uh, grab that information put some more parameters generate dynamic parameter based on the table and then use those parameter again here uh, we need to again click here transform data edit parameter and here you can choose for example laptop click ok and apply changes so here you can see these are the laptops and uh, the minimum order and all these things so it's very easy you, you don't need to go to the website you just need to select your queries here watch click ok apply changes so here you can see we are getting different watches their price rating and everything so this is very easy and very powerful to grab different results and you can experiment with different types of um, websites to grab different types of uh, results and uh, it will save your time and you you can make uh, the complete data set for your further analysis so if you like this video please subscribe our channel and if you have any question please write in the comment section thank you